Hey everyone, long time no see. I feel like it's been forever since I last had a video out for you guys. Anyway, so a lot has happened around the yard. As you can see, we are currently undergoing renovations, which is super exciting. We're planning on extending the barn so that there are more stables to house more ponies. I'm also planning on renovating the wash bay, but we'll see how that pans out. However, today I thought I'd make a little calm autumn vlog because I don't want to jump straight into something that's way over the top. But I definitely need to get to feeding the ponies because they do not sound happy at all. I'm coming, Quest! So, welcome to the temporary feed room, also known as the tack room. This is where I am making the ponies feeds while the feed room is being renovated. So before I forget, I'm going to show you what Maisie has every morning. So I start her feed off with a base of chaff because I want to make sure that she has enough fibre. Then I put in a scoop of Fawn Lake Feeds performance pellets just to make sure that she is getting the amounts of minerals she needs because she is a performance horse. Then I give her a scoop of low calorie balancer because she's been outside all summer you can certainly see the effect the grass has had on her. Next, I give her a scoop of Ready Racer. This just helps to keep her stamina up and glow and grow to keep her coat healthy. And of course, a couple treats on top. I will be changing their feed slightly as we go further into winter, but as of now, this is what she's got. So today I'm taking Ariel on a little hack around Moorland because she hasn't got any lessons today. Um, so normally the ponies are exercised every single day other than a few days off. Normally they will have a weekday and a Sunday off. So I just wanted to get her out and about to have some fun. And we did end up having a great time. We even went for a few gallops on the beach. So I'm back at the barn now with Quest. I finished up my hack with Ariel and she was lovely. We did so much and I'm so happy with her. Hopefully we'll get lessons tomorrow with her. So that means I won't have to ride her again, even though she is an amazing pony and I wouldn't mind it. Anyway, so I'm here with Quest now and I'm just going to lunge him. Um, just a quick lunge because we're going to a show soon and I want to make sure he isn't too spicy. So let's do that and then I can go bath him later.
So all I did next was take Quest back to the barn and give him a little bath before I put him back in his stable, just because I want him to get used to the fact that I will be bathing him a lot more, especially during winter, and because he is a baby, I wanted him to get used to that. So I just tied him up in the cross ties and gave him a quick rinse over before starting on the soap. For the shampoo, I used a green tea scented shampoo from Four Leg Equestrian Centre. It's really annoying because my favourite one to use is the peony scented one, but Quest doesn't like it, so that's a shame. I also give him some sprays to make his coat really shiny. I also give tedious tangles in his mane because it's absolutely horrendous, especially around this time of year. Then, of course, Happy Hoof Conditioner. because I wanted to exercise her before I turned her out. It's about 6pm so it's getting darker now but it's okay. Um, I'm just planning on doing a few courses. I haven't jumped Maisie in about a week so we'll see how she gets on. I'm hoping that we're going to jump about 90 maybe higher but who knows we might end up jumping very high. Okay, so I've just finished up with Maisie now and I'm just going to finish up by taking her out for the evening and then I can come do night checks and go home. I've had such a great day today and I'm looking forward to making so many more videos, especially the more exciting ones. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed the video and I will see you all next time. Bye!